All right, let's take a look at this one. So this looks like the lens has changed because now everything is correct. Which means you could still punch in if you want to, right? To get that type of framing. You would still get, you know, the door number will come in uh, and you get a nice facial stuff, you know? But the thing is, now you are, that's the half and you, I mean, it's, it's a cliche thing to do, but it's, it's a very useful beginning in terms of framing. So you could still, you know, with the guy, he could end up being here. <laughs> it's my massively long scribble, but you know, er, he could be here. And then just, you know, your other guy is just kind of here blurry, but that would be your full framing and you'd be in a nice thirds composition versus that that's just a bit low you know what I mean like there's some moments here where you're just kind of it feels like you want to reframe so you're not having all that empty space anyway that's just for framing the uh, knocking is cool just make sure that you know as you do this again this might change if you do all your the framing differences but this is all cool I love all this but um, the head seems to have like a head align or head IK so you can see how it just kind of stays put. So watch out for that. On something like this here, when he goes down, the shoulder will come down. It feels like by now you want to reorient the character. So it's he's a bit more straight up and the head is not so... Everything is kind of leaning over this way. So you can lean it back to the right. Like to this, but earlier. And this feels more like a pivot. You're pivoting off of you and rotating versus also a translate you know what I mean like he just kind of does a, a weight shift change to stand properly and it's just feels like a rotation in the in the spine in the upper spine you know the chest and not the root so that's just for that let's look at the other guy there's something weird here like I like all this like all that and here he's already looking at the fist so that by now it feels weird that from here to here it feels like the eyes are really parented to the head and they're kind of looking to the right and then they dart over almost looking at us during a blink and then you blink and then it go back but it's not looking at him and this eye is really cross-eyed and then here you got the big expression but this still feels like he's looking over his shoulder and only now do I feel like he's looking at him. And to me, it feels like you can just make this so much simpler. He gets to this, starts blinking while still looking towards the fist. And on the on the eye, on the when the eyes open, he is looking at the kid, which is here. Otherwise, it feels really confusing. Not confusing, but it feels like it's very, very unfocused. What are you doing there, Reynolds? Your DVD player broken? And I think you hear something in the, in the sound. What are you doing? Here, I can hear it does it. You know, like a little sound there. What are you doing there, Reynolds? It's kind of missing. It would happen around here. And to me, it feels like you could almost look at the guy longer, maybe look up and down and kind of size him up and like, and then. What are you doing? And then it's kind of, what are you doing? You know, just at that moment when he goes, that's almost to me like, that's the moment when he looks away from him. What are you doing? What are you doing here, Reynolds? Your DVD player broken? It's cool. The rest I like. What are you doing here, Reynolds? Your DVD player broken? The only thing is that once you hit this spot and I scrub through, there is a little bit of movement, which is cool, but there's nothing in terms of a bigger head arc, some accent, something that, it doesn't have to be, to be big. I'm not talking about something this big. I'm just talking about something where if you track the nose, it would just do like this, like this amount, and that's it. When you're Reynolds, your DVD player broken. Your DVD player broken. And that feels really late. The widening and the head move broken. Like I, I would actually keep that on the nose and keep that unbroken. Your DVD player broken. Broken or later it's just kind of in between where he might say broken 
broken like that or it's broken huh you know where it's a it's an accent afterwards and right now it's just in between it doesn't quite work dvd player broken stay in this versus that but anyway that's kind of the impression on this one uh, check out this guy cool I like it should have cut out much sooner cut you know There you go, cut there, and then the beginning I would actually cut in. So he's not moving, not moving, not moving. And then he start moving. And now the root moves. Even that feels a bit weird. But I guess you could. I would just cut in around here. See that? So you cut on action like he's already moving. I was just saying you might probably cut in later because then the camera is moving. So I would probably cut in here. So it really feels like it's a shot out of a sequence. And I can't tell you which frame because it's it's so small. There you go. Well, now I can't scrub. So I'm cutting out at 144. And hold on, I can tell you. I'm cutting in at 21. 21 is when I cut in. All right. Other than that, let's go back here. I think the only thing I would say is his way down is a bit simple. Just kind of a translate down with a little bit of a one axis type of thing. And then the same thing up. It's a cool how he goes up with the you know, the stomach thing going first, but it still goes in one axis. And I think you can have a little bit of a, a little bit of sideways lean, a little bit of a wire rotation. Give this a bit more complexity. So he gets up, you know, like he pushes off with one arm more than the other. So by now this would be a bit more stretch and this could be already a bit more bent. And then he gets back into this. And then watch out, there's some moments where it feels weirdly disjointed. Like the head is kind of stuck, the chest is moving separately, arms are doing something, the hips are doing something, but there is no there's no up or down or sideways on the hips. After all that movement here just kind of locks. Locks as in just I don't feel any momentum carrying over from this. I just kind of there with some rotations. That's cool. And that's cool. Yeah, it's neat. Now this guy. Your internet activity over the last 10 years is being scrutinized and cataloged in minute, vivid detail. I think all I would do is when you talk about beats. In minute. See this? Minute, and then it goes up and left and does this. Already left, right, left, right. And then the big one, and then this. To me, it feels like you want to do don't do that. Minute might be just from here to here. Minute. Hold, hold, hold. Don't move the head. And then then he goes. Then that. Because otherwise, to me, beat wise, it's just, there's always something moving. And I feel like this would be a great minute hold. The voice, nothing, you know, no one says anything. It's a hold and it's just he's walking, leaning over, talking, talking, minute, vivid detail. You know, so you got that contrast and that moment. Of silence, I think that would help beat wise, at least to me. Your internet activity over the last 10 years is being scrutinized. There's still some moments through here where this arm feels IK. Okay. The wrist rotation and the forearm. There's some funky stuff going on there. Same thing here. Because I see all that elbow movement while the wrist does not really move that much. I'm not talking up and down, I'm talking about the overall rotation this way not up and down so it feels a bit locked that feels a bit weird here where the elbow goes in but then the hand goes out and with the hand rotation not moving that much it feels very broken better this also the wrist feels like it's moving a lot compared to everything else in my new not too bad though probably the lowest of the notes but 
stuff at the beginning. Your internet activity over the last 10 years is being... Yeah, no, that's it. Your internet activity over the last... Give me the sound, the lip sync. This might just be the quick time, so this might not be a note. It just feels late. Your internet activity over the... And this feels a bit much. This feels like a whistle and not your... This could be a year between these two, but this is already a whistle. Your internet activity over the last 10 years is being... That's a cool shape. Your internet activity over the last 10 years is It just being... feels uh, short. I will get to this and hold this three frames longer at least. Years. Being scrutinized and cataloged. Something cataloged that's poppy. and this one you can see how the jaw goes uh, down and then suddenly up and really up it's over one frame direction change and it's really fast there and then pops one up and then one down again so I would simplify and add a frame just reduce this closing here it's too puppy then cataloged in minute vivid detail cool yeah that's it All right, there's an email, you can sign up, you can start whenever you want, you can submit whatever you want, you get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right, thank you.